What is going on everybody? Welcome back to the City of Z once again. I will be your tour guide today and I hope you enjoy your stay and today we're talking about Call of Duty Black Ops 3 Zombies of course. Once again we're talking about the DLC, the Iron Dragon, the map coming up for Zombies in DLC 1 for Call of Duty Black Ops 3 Zombies and today we've got some leaked-ish information, information that was found way back when in the beta coding when I actually brought this information said there's gonna be a castle map well we got there's other information in that coding and I'm gonna share it with you right now so make sure to subscribe make sure to leave a rating and make sure to comment your thoughts down in the comment section down below so we can all have an educated discussion on this following the video so anyway guys in the coding there is something very very interesting so we had the you know whole ZM castle thing right well then in addition to that what we find out is there's something called mech underscore WPN underscore flamethrower. Now, what does this mean? Well, it looks pretty similar to coding that just signifies a weapon. A weapon called the flamethrower. So does this mean that we're going to be getting a flamethrower in Call of Duty Black Ops 3 Zombies first DLC map? I think it's very likely based off the code. However, you know, it's totally subject to change. Treyarch could be doing whatever they want with this coding. They can change anything. So, I think this would be very intriguing. We haven't seen a flamethrower in zombies for a long time. Now, you might be like, yo, it's just a flamethrower. So what? It's in Black Ops 3 multiplayer. Maybe they're just throwing it in. Well, I think that it's actually going to be like an integral part of the map. If if it is indeed in the map whatever weapon whatever wonder weapon i think it's going to be very important for the map so if you look at shadows of evil and the giant they all have weapons that like are very integral to the map so for the giant you unlock the annihilator via an easter egg that's certainly plausible for how we can get the uh, flamethrower on uh, the iron dragon i think that would make a lot of sense now why is there a flamethrower on the uh, flamethrower in the iron dragon i don't know how do they get it who knows i think it's very likely but that's just based off the coding that is if the flamethrower there i think it makes sense i want to know what you guys have to think down in the comment section down below do you think it's plausible what do you think make sure to leave your thoughts make sure to subscribe so you don't miss future black ops 3 zombies coverage and i'll see you in the next video Psych, before I go, I just wanted to let you guys know about a little giveaway going on. The link will be down below in the description. You just follow the link if you want to enter a giveaway for a free PlayStation 4. I just said PlayStation. PlayStation 4 with Black Ops 3. You can go ahead and enter. Just follow the link. That's all you got to do. I'll see you guys next time. Have a great day. Peace.